2012 CAA Football Media Day Live. With the head coach of Villanova, Andy Talley. And coach, great to see you. 1997 Eddie Robinson Coach of the Year. And last year, uh, program certainly tough times, 2-9, 1-7 and nine, and seven in the conference. But you returned 21 of the starters from that team. You get a year older, a little bit more experienced. How much does that help? Well, I think it's uh, very good that we have these kids back. Uh, it was baptism by fire last year. And in our league, if you're young, uh, you're in harm's way. And we were last year for sure. Uh, really, that was our worst season in Villanova in my tenure of 28 years. Mm -hmm. But it was a team that you could hang with. They got better and better as the season went on. And uh, I'm, I'm very excited about the kids that are returning. You head into your 28th season at Villanova. What is the message to a team, again, coming off the bumps and bruises they took last year, but again, so much uh, to look forward to this upcoming season? Well, you know, we've never been under the radar like we are this year. Uh, I think we're picked eighth by everyone to finish, and uh, I think we've been able to use that with the players a little bit, give them the needle. Uh, we're not well respected right now. Uh, you know, we're on our heels. We got to get going. Uh, we got to bring Villanova football back and uh, you know so we've our kids are excited about that concept you know they really feel like we were a lot better than a two and nine team and we will be uh, as I say this team is young uh, exciting and uh, they can't wait to play respect can be a great motivator for a young player for sure. uh, sophomore linebacker Dylan Lucas last year defensive player of the year um, as a freshman freshman defense player of the year as a rookie Tell me about his maturity as he now takes that next step as a sophomore and a leader of a defense. Well, Dylan was 205 pounds last year, uh, was forced to play, had a great year as a freshman. He's 235 pounds now. So now he's grown up a little bit and he plays with a lot of intensity. Uh, he's a very, very good player, I think among the best in the league. And uh, we're looking forward to his leadership as a young sophomore. Growing up and growing out a little bit. That's, yes, uh, that's sure. a lot of extra muscle on your linebacker. Let's talk about offense a little bit. Quarterback situation. Where do you stand? You dealt with a lot of injuries in that area. Well, if you don't have a good quarterback, obviously, especially in our league, you're in harm's way. And we have a good young one coming up in Chris Poloni. Mm -hmm. uh, he'll be a sophomore. He played in five games last year. Had a great game against UMass. Uh, he was a little up and down. I think the game was just a little too fast for him. Uh, but I think it's slowed down for him in spring practice, and he's got a great arm. Uh, I think he'll be a terrific leader, and if he really has the kind of season I think he can have, we can be a team that can be heard from. How much does it help having a healthy Norman White, too, uh, for your team? Well, Norm White's big because he's uh, our pro prospect guy, a wide receiver, big 6'5 guy. He's your go-to guy. We missed him uh, last year around the goal line especially. He's the guy you want to get the ball to. He's your critical third down guy, and he's capable of big plays, and that's what we lacked last year. And you talked about quarterback. Sometimes a quarterback's best friend can be that big wide receiver, so that could help out uh, your guy quarterback there. You guys open against Temple. That is one of those uh, battles in Philadelphia that I know you said you look forward to. Um, how anxious is this team to get the season going, and especially playing against the Owls cross, cross town? It's a great rivalry. Uh, two teams that know each other well. Uh, obviously, Temple just went into the Big East. Uh, we actually beat them when they were in the Big East about 10 years ago. So uh, it's a local rivalry. Uh, neither team, uh, y y you know, it's going to be a super duper exciting day. Both teams get up for this game, and we we've loved the competition with Temple. Head coach of Villanova, Andy Talley, appreciate you uh, coming out and seeing you today here at CA Media Day. And best of luck this season. My pleasure. Thank All you. Right.